want to focus in on Nevada. Uh, MSNBC political analyst John Ralston, editor of the Nevada Independent and Nevada guru, joins us now. Now, John, we saw you a little earlier this evening, and the Clark County Las Vegas votes had just come in, and it was looking good for Joe Biden. Chuck took 45 minutes of a nap, and when <laughs> he came to, Nevada was a great deal closer. You have crunched the numbers. We all, we revere you, John. What do you think is going on in Nevada right now? No pressure, right, Savannah? Not, not, nothing, nothing yeah, don't blow this, Ralston. Uh, I wish I wish I could have taken a nap. God, the Chuck Todd, uh, he is an old man. <laughs> Listen, it, it is it is difficult uh, to tell exactly what, what is going to happen from here. Let me tell you what we know. Uh, Joe Biden has about a 7,500 vote lead now in Nevada. Uh, the, after those first Clark County numbers came in, a whole bunch of rural numbers came in. And then today's vote in Clark County came in where the Republicans did pretty well. Uh, the problem that Donald Trump has going forward from here, though, is that there are tens of thousands of ballots left. There may be more than 100,000 ballots. I'm going to find out more uh, uh, tomorrow, today, whatever the day is. And, and those are mail ballots. And the Democrats in Clark County have performed by better than the Republicans by a two to one margin. So it's highly unlikely. Are they Clark that, County, that, Las Vegas mail ballots? Is that what you just said? Uh, well, uh, that's the right question. Most of them are Clark County, Las Vegas uh, mail ballots. There may be as many as 70,000. Even the Secretary of State's office uh, just a little while ago wasn't quite sure. There, there are some mail ballots left in Washoe County, which, as Chuck knows, is the swing county in Nevada and that Trump really ba badly needed to do well in. But Biden uh, was ahead there uh, earlier and probably is going to keep that lead. And there may be a few mail ballots left in rural Nevada, but there are not enough votes out there uh, in, in the rural counties to save him if those Clark County ballots follow the same pattern which I believe they probably will. And I've also heard, by the way, that some Trump officials uh, essentially concede that and that they knew the game they played here and elsewhere is that they wanted to declare victory tonight, hmm. be ahead tonight, because they know that those mail ballots are going to hurt them, which is why they went uh, to court. And then Pete Williams mentioned one of the lawsuits three different times in the last week to try to block the counting of those mail ballots. And they failed all three times. Hey, John, one of the things that, that we keep talking about here when we watch, I mean, I saw Donald Trump overnights quite a bit in Las Vegas, but even this most recent swing out west, he overnighted, did something at the hotel, and then went back to campaign in Arizona. Did he have a good enough Nevada campaign, and had he had a better one? Do you think he might have uh, been able to uh, shock uh, shock you a little bit? Well, I, I, listen, I'm not I'm not shocked, but I am pretty surprised that it's as close as it is, considering that the Democrats had banked so many votes. Now, Chuck, you know that it was a different kind of election in Nevada. They changed the law in a special session. The Democrats control all the levers of power in Carson right. City here, and they and they and they mandated the mail election, which is what upset all these Republicans. But all, considering all of that. Uh, they did a pretty good job of, of, of voter contact, getting mm -hmm. volunteers out there better than, than they have in the past. But, hey, Chuck, John. you know this is a very tough, tough state yeah. for a Republican to win statewide because the Democratic machine is so powerful right. in getting a registration lead and then turning out those voters. All right, John, i got to cut it there. We're getting into meet the press territory <laughs> here. This is the Today Show. He's just about to do me. hashtag we matter. I know, anyway, I know. Just, t just tell me real quick, John, I, I thought I read a wire that said Nevada officials decided not to count any more votes until Thursday morning, <laughs> yeah. which is tomorrow. Is that right? That's not quite right, although I painfully read the date November 5th, uh, just as you did. They're going to spend all day tomorrow counting. Uh, they don't They don't plan to post any results, though, uh, and, until uh, November 5th. And so after, after I take a Chuck Todd-like nap, I'm going to call them and hector them that they should uh, Please. be posting those numbers. Well, the yeah, wind will be at your that. back, John. They're going to count today, but maybe not release yeah. till Thursday. Thursday. We'll all right, we, we're relieved. We were a little nervous. They weren't even going to count today. I know, We'd like no. a day off, we're too much juice Ralston really has in Nevada. Thank you very much. Uh